This is the newest offering solar panel from Bouge RV, 120 watts, extremely lightweight for a folding solar panel, and very high efficiency. Bouge RV refers to this as their 9BB 120 watt portable solar panel. Uh, it does come with this nice uh, protective padded case, easy to put the solar panel in and out of, and it zips up. The thing about this solar panel is it's lightweight. Linda and I, our, our very first solar panel was a Renogy 100 watt suitcase, uh, a really high quality, durable, an extremely heavy solar panel that we we stopped taking with us because it was just too hard. Linda couldn't lift it in and out of the back of the car. It was extremely heavy. So we went to uh, lighter weight portable solar panels. This one though only weighs 10.36 pounds and it's comparable to uh, other fabric type folding solar panels. It's Comparable to this, this weighs about nine and a half pounds and this one's only a pound more. So this one's fabric, uh, they're great panels, but um, this one is designed for people who want a solid, a rigid panel, uh, which makes them easier to point at the sun and also um, a little more stable when they're up, not as easy to blow down. Easy to open up. And you see on the back side here, the way that it folds open. The one thing I do like about it is um, you're not dealing with Velcro here, which you open and it closes by itself and you have to open it again several times as you're trying to lay it down. Uh, this is just simpler. It, uh, the connection here is, it comes out as MC4 out of the panel as MC4 connectors. And then they include this extension here that goes down to uh, eight millimeter and then there's adapters for different sizes to go into most power stations. One of the things that makes it so lightweight is that the panels are not glass. They're more like the portable solar panels that uh, the fabric ones, except that these are rigid and thin and very lightweight. On the top it's got a nice folding handle which also, uh, when you have it in its bag, it extends out the top so you can carry it. Like that. Yeah, at this weight, it competes directly with the folding fabric panels. The designation 9BB means 9 bus bar, and it's supposed to make it uh, more efficient than the other uh, competing panels, which are 5 bus bar. Now, I'm no expert. I don't know what that means. Maybe you can tell me, but it's supposed to make it uh, more efficient. Also supposed to make a lower cell operating temperature, um, which is supposed to make it last a lot longer than other solar panels. You know, solar panels do wear out. They have a lifespan. This one's supposed to last longer. Now, one of the strong features of this panel is that it has an, a waterproof rating of IP67. And if you look that up, you'll find out that IP67 means this can stand a strong jet of water 
sprayed directly on it or its components and it won't hurt it, meaning this panel can be left out in the rain and you don't have to worry about it. Let's get it outside and see how it does. Well, the sun came out and the wind's not blowing. It's only five degrees, but I've, it's the first chance I've had to test this out. I've been waiting for a couple weeks. In the meantime, I'm gonna try not to slip and break my neck on the ice out here. Opening it up is easy. You just flip these levers up, give them a half a turn, and that releases them. To test it out, I'm using this Upez, and uh, it's warm from being in the house. So we don't have to worry about trying to charge it in freezing temperatures. 79, let's just see here, tilting it different directions here, or different ways. The sun is really low right now. This is Christmas Eve in Montana. 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84. And that's about as good as we're going to get with this low winter sun. <laughs> and a slight haze over it too. So, all right. Let's get this back inside and talk about it. It's cold out here. Hey, the one thing that I've got going for me is, as a gift, I was given a heated jacket. And it can get up to 140 degrees inside here. I'm really enjoying it. Now, my panel did show up with the um, hardware. It all vibrated loose on it. So, on both sides. And I notified the company that that had happened. So, what I'm going to do is... I'm going to put it all back together with some uh, thread locker. And I, and I already notified them that this happened and they're, they're going to look into that and see if they can do something to make this hardware not come loose. The vibration did it in shipping. So anyways, I'm going to put it together with some Loctite and call her good. These things won't come apart again. The important specs are right here on the box. 120 watts. Cells efficiency, solar cells efficiency, 23.5. This is the highest I've ever seen, 23.5. The highest I've seen before this has been 23. Uh, here's your max power voltage, 18.5 volts. Uh, this is your max power current, 6.49 amps. Open circuit voltage, 23 or 22.3 short circuit current 7.03 amps max system voltage 1000 volts dc and your operating temperature here of minus 40 degrees fahrenheit to 185 degrees fahrenheit well the warranty on this panel is 18 months and currently the price on amazon is 220 dollars and then there's a 20 dollar uh, coupon bringing it down to 200 dollars and be sure and check the video description below for any cost savings through Gone Again. Check that out and see what's offered down below. If, if, and if, if anything is offered right now, make sure that you get it. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the review. If you did, please like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you around.